We're up on the ridge. As you can see, it's a gentle slope. There's actually some rock formations and a tree, and uh, that's where we're going to have lunch, about 200 feet ahead. And it goes down, and uh, we climb the rocks. I'll, sh I'll get up close, and I'll show you how far we climbed. We were all the way at the bottom of this canyon, and we worked our way all the way up this, to this peak. And you can see the Carson, the Carson Valley. It's, you know, it's pretty vast. And uh, I mean, there's Job's Peak right there. It's almost 11,000 feet, if not over 11,000. I've been getting different reports, like 10 different places say different elevations. I don't know. But it is a massive monolithic mountain. And, and uh, you know, we have to consider the fact that this is such a vast area that Bigfoot could roam in. I'm going to show you something else real quick. There's a, well, we passed it, but there's a tree that's so thick, it is unbelievable. I mean, it's like, the, it would take eight people to hug it to reach its circumference. Uh, you can see over here, because now we're getting views on both ends of this mountain, but you can see a vast high desert, which this high desert ahead of us leads into the Carson Pass, which leads into the heart of the Sierras. And of course, I'll let you check it out through the trees. It's very brown because that's a very, it's an old desert really right in there. And it's desert for, you know, high desert for a good five, six miles. And then it turns into an alpine forest. So our hike has been very successful. We found Bigfoot evidence. We've seen some things. Uh, there's a lake. I'm going to show you this. That might be Indian Lake. Indian Lake Reservoir so there's a lot of things to see we got about 300 feet till we reach the actual peak there about 300 feet there's these rocks you climb and a trees on top and that's the peak and that'll probably overlook and surpass everything we've ever done in this area so far anyways this is Lord Rick of the Paranormal Ghost Society we got Jared throwing rocks he's trying to break them open he's looking for gold I don't blame them. Sometimes we do find gold, so you do what you got to do, right? And, you know, the price of gold keeps going up, and it could help fund new cameras for all the cameras we break on these expeditions. Anyways, this is Lord Rick of the Paranormal and Ghost Society. We are almost at the peak. We're doing it, man. We're doing it. Let's chill. Let's party. Let's smoke a cigar. Let's drink a brew. And let's enjoy what Mother Nature has to offer in Bigfoot, too. Why not? Why not? These are the journeys of the paranormal in Ghost Society.